Let me explain to you why the 801 is so important to all of us. I think one of the most interesting things about working here is we get asked all the time about the most important loudspeakers that we produce. The Nautilus, of course, is the one that gets all the attention because it's such a glamorous piece because it has that amazing kind of eye-catching appeal to it. That said, if you ask anybody who works in and around the acoustic team, anybody who has any kind of history with a company, what they consider to be the most important loudspeaker we produce, we're all going to say the same thing. It's the 801. Because the 801 is the piece that has not only the longevity from the point of view of its pedigree, the most important loudspeaker that probably emerged in John Bowles' lifetime, the product that he introduced in 1979 to set the new tone for the 1980s. That's where the name comes from first generation of a new type of loudspeaker for the 1980s, the 801. You may not have heard an 800 series loudspeaker or may not have thought that you have, but actually you have because somewhere along the line in one of the many feature films that the product's contributed to or one of the many pieces of music that it's been involved with from the point of view of monitoring and mastering, it's contributed and as a result it's influenced how you have been and how you've grown up even if unwittingly you didn't know that was happening. 801 in its own right emerged in 1979 as an individual model. It's indicated its first fundamental change in 1987 when it went through a ported design that introduced the matrix assembly. The 1987-801 matrix really propelled the product forward to a broader audience. The next really significant change point is 1998 where we go from the more traditional rectilinear kind of cabinet construction through to the curved cabinet construction. The next really significant change will be 2005, the introduction of the diamond diaphragm. We refined that again in 2010 and then in 2015 we had our most recent overhaul to the fundamental form of the industrial design by changing the cabinet wrap structure as we refer to it to the reverse wrap so we went from if you like an inverted u-shape like that to the form that we now have the reverse wrap structure that then was revised again in 2021 with the latest generation the fourth generation of 800 series diamond the d4 and that's where we are today the 801 is the king, it's the most important loudspeaker, it's the speaker I think that represents everything that we know and everything that we are. It's generational, it's got all the excellence that we have from an engineering point of view built into it. It's the only model that can be used effectively both in home use and in studio use and it's used in the most important recording studios across the world to create the most important film music and music scores that you can think of. So it represents I think Bowers and Wilkins in every regard in one product.